G'day, 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 Roger here, and today I'm going to show you how amazingly easy and quick it is to send a real postcard online, cost about $1.50 or so, including postage, so there's no need to go to a shop and choose a card, write on it and put a stamp on it, and then take it to the post office to send it. Not anymore, not only are you going to see how easy it is to send a greeting card with send out cards, but also how easy it is to include a photograph of your own. So here we go, you log into your card manager, and you click on the card catalog. There's over 15,000 card designs to choose from, or you can even create a card with your very own design from front to back. Now in the card catalog, you've got all the different categories, expressions, holidays and occasions, keeping in touch, my card, special collections and so forth. Now on Sunday, I took my youngest daughter to Movie World and she won a toy piggy at a fairground ride. So what I'm going to do is thought, why not send her a uh, card to remember special times by with little piggies on it. So we go search for pig, see if we can find a card of some little piggies on the front. There's a whole bunch to choose from. Now when you look at a card, you roll over it and it shows you what's inside. So me, forget your big day. It's an all different themes. You can actually change your uh, captions as well. Now when it's got a little arrow on the side and you, and you roll over that, it shows you what's inside the card. So you can create a postcard, a one-fold card, or two-fold card. You can attach a gift to it as well. So we'll go down. That's the card design I want. So I'm going to do a postcard. So you click on that. And this is where we design the card. Now on the front, we'll leave that the way it is. On the inside, I want to put a photo of us on there. So we'll go click Add and Remove Pictures. Now I want the photo below the text. Now to upload a photo, you click on the image and you can either add a picture plus picture that you've saved where you might have put a caption or something on there or you can upload a raw image is what we're going to do here. Now it needs to be about 2 to 4 megapixel plus to make sure that your, uh, the quality of the picture is uh, photographic quality when they print it. So I'm going to use this one here. Now this is a fairly big file and it's about 2.5 megabytes or so, so depending on the speed of your connection uh, and it'll determine how fast your photo will upload naturally. So it may take a little while, but it is fairly quick as you can see on wireless. Alright, that's done. Here's the photo. High quality, which is good. You want to make sure that your printer quality is shown as high. So that's done. I'm going to add a message. It's got to change the font size a little bit smaller. So you can make your uh, type styles big or small, whatever. There's a whole bunch of fonts you can choose from, including your own handwriting. So we say, hi, Katrina. This little piggy held the camera. Just make it a little bit smaller because it didn't quite fit that in. So I'll make it 11. And that's it. When you're happy with the design, um, continue. And this is where you add the recipient's address. So it's Katrina. And that's it. Now you can choose to actually set, uh, save that to your contact manager. Now you hit continue. And that's it. Confirm, okay, glossy finish, the recipient's address, delivery information. You can actually choose whether you want to send it immediately on the birthday, anniversary, or on a uh, specific date. So we'll, uh, we'll send the card immediately, which means it goes out in the next production run, which are normally every hour or two. Now, total cost for the card is uh, one point for the card and one point for the uploaded picture and uh, postage cost of uh, 45 cents. Uh, that's in US dollars, which equates to 55 cents Australian. 
So, um, yeah, that's it. You send a card by clicking on the send card button, and that's done. Now, to check on the progress of your card, go to your main menu, and from here, you can find the cards that you've sent. So, uh, we'll just have a look at this. So, there's Katrina's card. You can actually view and edit the cards if you uh, want to make some changes, or by clicking here, you can actually remove it off the production, so you can actually cancel a card if you decide you don't want to send it. So we'll click on that, view and edit card, and there's the card, which is fine. So uh, we'll go back because we do want to send that. So that's how easy it is to, uh, to make a postcard and uh, put your own photo on the other side and uh, send it to someone you love and care about. But anyways, live with passion, and uh, we're back with another training video soon.